from the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. And one, two, three. These men are well known around the UC Davis Medical Center. They are a special lift team dedicated to moving patients. This newly created team is lightening the load for nurses. Before we had the lift team, we'd have to call all the nurses together to help transfer some of our larger patients. Now we can set up appointments with the lift team to come help us move them. It leaves the nurses able to take care of their other patients. And the patients love them too because they have the best techniques and the newest equipment to move the patients and it's a lot more comfortable for them. So we go home at the end of the day with, we don't have sore backs anymore. And that means fewer injuries. Since we implemented in December, we've had no workers' comp injuries related to transferring patients or lifting patients. One of those trays, okay? Mm -hmm. Ready? And, mm. The lift team has a total of nine members who work on two-person teams around the clock. The hospital decided that they wanted to implement the lift team because of the uh, amount of money we were spending on workers' comp injuries and the way we were limiting people's careers. The teams train together and learn how to lift. 20-year-old Joey Janello says lifting hospital patients is especially challenging. Going into intensive care units, finding out different ways to do the lift, being safe, making sure all the lines are where they're supposed to be. Calls for service for the lift team have increased in the short time they've been in business. On any given day, about 140 patients take advantage of their strength and expertise. Reporting from the UC Davis Medical Center, I'm Paul Fotenauer. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.